corrosion. Corrosion is the slow eating away of metals by the action of oxygen and water that is moisture from air. Most metals are affected by corrosion. Iron oxidizes easily in moist air forming brown rust that is nothing but iron oxide. This is called rusting of iron. Rusting of iron does not stop at the surface of the metal. It goes deep into the metal till all of it is rusted away. Rusting of iron is a highly damaging corrosion process. It destroys iron fixtures in home and in industries respectively. Iron is protected from rusting by coating it with paints of other protective metals like zinc and nickel which is called galvanizing and electroplating. Cooking vessels made of copper and brass are generally given a coating of tin to prevent corrosion. This is called tinning. Here's a wonder. The iron pillar standing near Qutub Minar in Delhi is a metallurgical wonder since it is standing unaffected by the weather for over 1600 years. Aluminium on being exposed to air and moisture begins to corrode forming a coating of its oxide on its surface. Copper gets coated with greenish brown coating of copper carbonate formed as a result of copper combining with carbon dioxide and moisture present in the air. Some metals get corroded only on the surface. Silver invariably gets blackened due to the formation of a coating of silver sulphide as a result of reaction between silver and hydrogen sulphide gas present in the air. This layer formed as a result of corrosion itself becomes a protective layer and checks for the corrosion. Metals like copper and aluminium are electrically coated with their oxides to prevent corrosion. Such a process is called anodizing. In addition to corrosion by reaction of a metal with oxygen and moisture from air, metals may also get corroded by the action of acids and alkalis.